Yes, well, I'm a singer-songwriter, so I'd love to work with uh, Mark Ronson. I'd love to do a song with him. Um, I'm really into the collaborations that Diplo's been doing lately, so there's a lot of producers and songwriters that I love right now that are amazing. What's your favorite travel destination right now? Um, well, I went to Tulum for New Year's Eve, and I'd never been before, and it was really beautiful. Uh, it's, I feel like it's starting to get a little bit overrun with tourists now, so maybe that's sort of over, but I loved it. I love the beach. I grew up on the beach in Texas. If there's only like one food you can have for your whole life, what would it be? It would definitely be french fries. I love, I love crispy french fries. And if there's like only one outfit you can have for your whole life? <gasps> That's hard. I, I feel like I really express myself through my clothes. Um, I have to choose two because for the daytime I really like to wear jeans and like a cute vintage t-shirt. Um, but then I also like really big uh, vintage dresses too for like events and parties and stuff. Do you like um, use social media a lot? I do. I use Instagram a lot because I feel like it's good for my music um, just to let people know like when I'm playing shows when I have a new single out post clips of music videos um, but I definitely feel like I spend too much time on there sometimes you can really get sucked in like, looking at other people's Instagram and so it's like has its pros and cons for sure but you would say like um, social media is a really good like marketing for yourself right It is, definitely. I feel like we're in the best time now to be an independent artist and to be able to market yourself, but then at the same time, everybody's doing it. So, you know, only a few people have millions of followers. So even though everybody can market themselves, you're still trying to catch attention from a lot of people, so it's so hard. But do you have like another idea or another marketing strategy to get like attention? No, that's a really good question. It makes me think of the girl that tattooed Harry Styles' picture on her face. Um, no, I feel like for me it's just actually about writing really good songs. And I don't know the best way for people to discover them, but I feel like if you do, people will always love music. So I feel like if you create good music, hopefully there's a way for it to eventually catch on and pe for people to hear it. Do you have belief in horoscopes? I don't really but also because um, I, I was a preemie, so I was born like three weeks early. Like um, my mom was accidentally induced before I was supposed to be born. So I'm an Aquarius, but if I had been born on my actual due date, I would have been, I think, a Pisces. So whenever I read my horoscope, I feel like it's not really right. And I wonder if maybe, I don't know, if the Pisces is supposed to be the more correct horoscope for me. I mean, sometimes I do read it because I'm kind of cur I'm always interested in like more esoteric spiritual things, but I don't know. It seems like how could that be correct for an entire group of people? And thank you, and have a nice evening. Thank you. you it too. was nice meeting you. Nice to meet you. <laughs>